Good morning. Today I want to talk to you a little bit about, you know, uh, you've got the uh, you've got the full warranty, but uh oh, this part's not covered. Now I'm going to start out with this uh, Samsung TV here. Now it works, and I can't watch it, but it doesn't do near like what it's supposed to do. And after 30 days, it started real acting acting up really bad, and so I called. Uh, Best Buy about that's where we bought it from and after about 35 or 40 days I forgot what it is now they don't want to hear nothing from you so you just scratch them off you got to call Samsung and if you've ever called Samsung and tried to talk to some of those people you know what a run around it is because they're going to tell you all kinds of uh, computer technical uh, larger, uh, jargon that you don't know nothing about probably I, I was lucky I didn't know something about what he was talking about so I was able to get it so it would play a little bit so but I'm just going to tell you from now on if I ever buy another TV and which I will but <laughs> as soon as this uh, 55 inch Samsung Curve TV goes completely bad that's the only time my wife will let me buy another TV I'm going to go with uh, I'll either get it from uh, Costco's or BJ's or uh, or maybe I'm not familiar with Sam's that much, but I've heard they're pretty good too. But I know from experience that Costco's and BJ's will take, take stuff back after 30 days. It's not just, you know, buy it now and don't never come back. We don't hear from you anymore. So just to let you know that's what it is on the TVs from uh, Best Buy. So, and this is just my opinion now. Y'all make up your own mind about anything you want to. I'm just telling you about if you get the bad one, which I can pick out a box out of a thousand, and mine's going to be the bad one. But if you can do that yourself, then I'm just telling you for your own sake, you know, buyer beware. <laughs> now the second thing I want to tell you about, and I don't think they even do it anymore, because well, I shouldn't have done it to start with. But anybody that knows me knows if I can get a box of toothpicks, and if they say register it, and get another free box of toothpicks. I'm, I will register that box of toothpicks. And now these batteries here, these uh, rigid batteries, when we first started buying these rigid tools, I said, oh, these batteries are guaranteed for life. All you gotta do is register them. And sure enough, about the first time or two, I think I changed them two times. And sure enough, they was registered right there, and lo and behold, the third time, they said, oh, well, you didn't register that. You know, <laughs> and so, what are you going to say? You know, and the salesman, is, or the, the, the associate at the store, he's just standing there looking at you, grinning, knowing he ain't going to give you nothing. But being Home Depot, as far as I know, is the only ones in the world that sells these things that I've been able to find. And so they say, nope, nope, we ain't giving you nothing. You know, you didn't register it. Your phone number's not in there. So what are you going to say? You know, like I say, he's just standing there smiling. He's not saying nothing to you because he knows he's not giving you anything else forever. And so I don't think they do that lifetime deal anymore. So anyway, another little thing you be aware of on that lifetime warranty. Okay, now this is my third one I'm getting to. Now this is from Sears. This is the, the Barbecue Pro. And I like this grill. And I've got that. I had that full warranty. The salesman tell you, he says, if anything ever goes wrong with that grill, all you got to do is let us know, and if we can't fix it, we're going to replace it. And they were pretty good for a while, just like with the batteries in there. They were pretty good for a while, and then all of a sudden, they started getting a little sketchy about that too, you know. And I've always kept up my, kept up my uh, warranty on it. But anyway, now... The back end is starting to rust in too. Let me go around there for a second. And you can see right here all this rust coming up here and along here. That's a big hole there. Start to let some air in here. And there it's getting all rusty. And this is breaking apart there. And this is busted loose here. You can see light through that and from the other side. But lo and behold, that part's not covered. So, like I said, it's just my opinion, but bear beware, you know, of these lifetime and and if it ever breaks, we'll go replace it because it's not true. They're not going to replace it. Okay, this is my pool liner. 
I had it in uh, my above ground pool for three years. I got it from Pinch Penny. And let me show you this. We got here and we rip it like that. Now you know, anybody's got a, ever had a above ground pool, a put a pool on it and knows it's not supposed to rip like that. <laughs> you know, so I'm just saying, you know, and I've called them, I've went down there two times and they they say, oh, we'll, we'll, we'll get back to you as soon as we can get hit, in touch with the bosses or something like that, you know. But you don't ever hear nothing else from them. That's been two weeks ago, or four weeks ago now. So, anyway, just to let y'all know, from now on, that's my chlorine store, and that would be about it. That's just my opinion. Y'all do what you want. Well, on this pool here, you can see rust on that one. This one's even got worse rust on it. This one's got rust on it. That one's got rust on it. That one. That one. And these other two here, that one's got it. And that one's got it. My point being, this pool is supposed to be guaranteed for 25 years, and so you can see what shape it's in after three. And the, now the liner is only supposed to be guaranteed for five years. So it only had two more years on the warranty about it. But now, like I said, they're supposed to call me back four weeks ago, and I've not heard nothing from them since. Now I've inquired about it two times. Pool with a super duper lining. Like this one, working on about three times a week. See, I don't know if you can see it or not, but you can see the light coming through down there in the back. That's where those holes are rusting through. Whether it's tools, I just want to let you know this experience as I've had. Now, you might have the same experience I've had. I'm just telling you what I've had, and y'all just beware of these, uh, yeah, the whole thing's covered. No matter what happens to it, we're going to replace it if it goes wrong, and we can't fix it, because they will not do it. And they'd be lucky as, as anything if they just stand by the regular warranty. But to give you the, if it's, if it's, if it's broken, we can't fix it, we're going to replace it, they won't. So anyway, that's my little thing for today, my little rant. So. I hope you enjoyed my video because I sure did enjoy making this video and will enjoy putting it on. And I hope y'all come back and see me real soon. Give me a thumbs up and uh, join my channel if you can. And so until next time, I'll see you later. And like I said, this is just my opinion about what I have purchased and what I've ended up with. So y'all have a good day now and come back and see us real soon now, okay? Goodbye.